Hello everyone, and here is Bob from Bob's Creations, and here is a short video about lag. And I decided to make this video because there is many, many videos on the YouTube that don't cover the pretty much relevant parts and how to actually reduce lag if all of the other stuff doesn't work. So yeah, if all these other videos didn't help you reduce lag, this is the video for you. Now the first thing we need to check, which has nothing to do with Second Life, is the temperature of our CPU and our GPU. Now, depending on your computer setup, you might either find this in Task Manager or uh, a program that comes with your computer. In my case, that is uh, Dragon Center, which is part of MSI. But you want to figure out your own tools that go with your PC. So, as you can see, my computer is um, 47 degrees Celsius and then 66 degrees Celsius on the CPU, which are both pretty good temperatures. Um, if you have anything like 80 to 90 degrees Celsius um, on either this GPU or the CPU, your computer will start thermal throttling, which will drastically reduce uh, the speed of your PC, in which case you might want to get your computer checked out before you get even worse things going on. So yeah, check your temperatures. If that is above 100 or above 90 C, get your computer checked out by some technician guy. Uh, second thing you want to do is check your task manager and then uh, check the performance of your PC. You can check your CPU, your memory, see if that is all in order. Uh, you want nothing to be at 100%. And then if you have two GPUs, as you can see, I have a GPU zero and gpu one you want to make sure that stuff like second life runs on your dedicated graphics card instead of on your microprocessor but yeah that stuff you can find in there and then um inside of sl there is also a bunch of things that we can do i'm not going to cover draw distance and stuff like that because you know that's like the stuff that everyone knows about um, most relevant thing in here, which everyone already says, advanced lighting takes up a lot of system resources. So turning advanced lighting off will drastically reduce lag. Putting point lighting also reduces a lot of lag. Um, water reflections also. So you want to set this pretty much like I have here. This stuff will just slide it to medium or low and ignore all of this for the time being. Hardware settings. Disable all this stuff, just make sure enable stream VBO is on. And one thing that no one tries, disable dynamic texture memory. Disabling dynamic texture memory can drastically increase the speed of your second life. It doesn't have to be, but depending on your computer, try turning this off. Test it. If you have a if it's like super like a uh, super jump in fps leave this off if it doesn't change anything then turn it back on so it's kind of like trial and error try turning it on try turning it off and you will see the difference and that is the whole thing pretty much um make sure these things are off make sure enable texture memory is off set these settings more or less like this make sure to go to catch and clear your invent clear your catch and then restart your browser to see if uh, restart your viewer to see if everything is good and also don't set texture cat size to a uh, too high number so number like 2024 should be fine for both uh, and this should pretty much give you the least amount of lag possible if this doesn't work you might need a better computer or a different computer. Anyways, I hope this helps you guys. Um, leave me a comment, leave me a like, and uh, see you in Second Life.